A great feature of Sketch is the ability to quickly and easily extend the functionality with a plugin. To install plugins, we can head to our menu and select Preferences, select Plugins from the menu, and we can select the Skit plugins. Now another way to access this same page is to head to sketchapp.com and select Extensions. Here you'll find a list of featured plugins. From here, we can select the View All from here, we're able to now search for plugins based on keywords. The plugin we're going to be looking for is Sketch Measure. So we can just type in Measure. And as you can see, Sketch Measure is one of our options. When we select Sketch Measure, it's going to take us to that particular plugin's website. In this case, it's a GitHub page. From here, we can select Clone or Download, and then select Download Zip. This is going to download a zip, which is going to contain the plugin file. If I head to my downloads, you can see I now have a sketch measure zip file. If I double select this, it'll unzip the file and I'll have a folder. Inside of this folder, I will have a .sketch plugin file. Now this plugin file is all you need to install this plugin. We'll simply just double click this plugin file. And as you can see, we now have a message from within sketch saying that sketch measure was installed. If we click OK, now Sketch has closed our current window, however it left open the Preferences pane, where we can now see that we have Sketch Measure version 0.9.4.8 installed, and it's checked to show that this plugin is active. Now let's go ahead and just open a new project, we can just have that be Command N with New. So to get started, let's create an artboard, I'm just going to just have this be a standard desktop responsive website. Now I'm going to hit R, create a rectangle here. Now, you'll notice that if we head to plugins in our menu, we can now see that we have measure. We have our other measure, you can see all of the different options we have along with settings for sketch measure. Let's go ahead and select measure size. And we can select our standard resolution. And as you can see, the sketch plugin sketch measure has created not only these lines, but these dimensions that's showing us the exact pixel dimensions of this rectangle. You can see if I select the rectangle, 350 height by 481 width, and we now have these in here as their own folders. That way, if we don't need these, we can always turn them off and hide them from the actual design. However, if somebody's coming in here and needs to know the actual dimensions at a glance, they can do so without selecting any of your layers or having to look up the properties themselves. Sketch Measure is a really great way to build visual design cues directly on your document. So head to sketchapp.com forward slash extensions forward slash plugins to check out some of the plugins created by the amazing third-party developers who've taken the time to create these plugins for Sketch.